Let's see who else. Uh, well, De Niro, mm -hmm. Pacino. I mean, yeah, you know, I could yes. go. I could go down the list. Yes. You know, what I mean, it's just yes. a lot of great, great actors mm -hmm. out there. Mm -hmm. um, uh, George Clooney. I love his yes. work, man. George. Yes. I mean, from his, you know, he, you know, he does a lot of comedic stuff, and then he, mm -hmm. then he turns mm -hmm. around and goes serious on you. Go, mm -hmm. wow, this guy. You know, he's showing different sides. You know, mm -hmm. and I like that. That's what I'm saying about being able to, you know, stretch out and and and, sh and not not just be. Tight cast. Yeah, right. Tight cast into yes. this cop. You know, yes. Like, yes. Let me, you know, I could Stretch be. Stretch your arms. Yeah, a yeah I could be that yes. lawyer. I could be that psycho dad. You yes. know what I mean? All yes. that stuff. You okay. Know what I mean? Good so. deal. Good deal. <laughs> now, Chris, what are some of the challenges you've been faced with being a career actor? Uh, I guess especially being from this area, um, the challenges come just trying to get the work from here, because like like when when. Um, when like a lot, when a lot of films come to Philadelphia, uh, the industry tends to still get the the lead actors from California, oh, New places, York, yes. mm -hmm. and when they come here, you know you're lucky if you get this little bit part mm -hmm. here or that. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? So yes. trying to move up the ladder from this standpoint is mm -hmm. really hard, and it's, and and it's sad because we have the talent here. Absolutely, we you understand do. what I'm saying? Yes, we, we have we the do. talent, and, yes. and 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 somehow we deserve. The chance to really get that that break that we need, mm -hmm. you know, everybody can't afford to go to California. Absolutely, yes. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. You know, with me with the four kids, you know what I yes. look like? I can't stay there. I can go for months at a time, maybe, but I gotta come back. You Absolutely, know what I mean? I, yes. My presence still needs to be seen around the house with mm -hmm. the kids and the wife and yes, all nine. Yes. So. And even even if you take that chance and go in there, you're, it, it is a chance that you're taking. And to go there would be because you're hired to go there, not because you're going there to, to see try to get work. work. Right, exactly. right, right, yes. right. Well, I've done that though. I've done yes. that too. You mm -hmm. know what I mean? Just mm -hmm. trying to get the work. You know, mm -hmm. nobody knows I'm coming. Nobody's expecting me. You yes. know what I mean? Yes. So that's yeah, that's <laughs> that's that's yeah, a challenge. That's, that's tough. Yes. Yeah. Now, right now, what is Chris most proud of in his life? My kids. Wonderful. They're kicking it. Yes. They are kicking it. All yes. I mean, all my kids, straight A's, mm -hmm. honor roll, distinguished honor Wonderful. roll, student yes. of the month, yes. dean's list, you name oh. it, man. I'm just, you know, I that can't be happier wonderful. for that. You know, that, that, that keeps me going. Yes, proud yeah. dad. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> <laughs> now, I noticed, uh, Chris, that your live theater is not as extensive mm -hmm. as your TV and film. Have right. you ever thought about going back to live theater? Uh, I mean, I've, I've thought about it. Mm -hmm. um, it... I mean, it's a good training ground, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? Like I said, I study with theater groups also and mm -hmm. done a little bit of theater and, you know, it's a good training ground, but, mm -hmm. um, I, you know, I see, every, I think everybody likes different mediums for different reasons. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I, I, what I get from a lot of people who do a lot of theaters, they, they love that instant gratification yes. of being on stage. Yes. I know, you know, I think because I, my work background, I've always been in a work environment. Mm -hmm. So, like, when you're on a set, everybody's working. It's yes. not about a crowd and pleasing everybody out in the crowd. It's about, let's yes. get this job done. You yes. know what I'm saying? Yes. So, that, I guess I have a blue-collar kind of uh, take on acting. Okay, you know what I'm yes, saying? Okay, yes, I do, yes. So, so mm -hmm. I think that's why I'm, I'm more drawn to that right okay. now. Okay, yeah. okay. That's, that, that's interesting because, you know, some actors, you know, like, for instance, I interviewed Nakia, and he says, I just love it all, you know, yeah, right, I gotta right. be on stage, you know, to, <laughs> right, you know right, and, right. and it's interesting how you put that in perspective on, you know, focusing on television and film versus, uh, yeah, the versus theater. Right, yes, right, yes. Right. Now, have you ever thought about you directing? Know, so, right now, it's so hard to get money, though. Mm -hmm, you mm -hmm. know, the and, funding is, is oh tight. Oh, my God. Yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I mean, you beat your head off the wall for years yes. just trying to get one project done. So, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I mean, I, 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 I think about it, but I shy away from it just because of that aspect. Okay. You know, cause I still, I'm still focusing on what I want to get. Yes. You know, I was always told, I was told years ago, if there's five Brinks trucks going down the street and they're all full of money, which one are you going to go after? You can't chase them oh, all. You got to go after one. You yes. get one first and then you can, you know, maybe yes. you can catch another one after that. Yes. You know what I'm saying? Yes. So. Love that analogy. <laughs> yes. Very nice. If you could change something about the Philadelphia arts community, what would that be? Uh... Well, well, for me, it's the, on the perspective of film and television. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, I, I would like it. I wish it was bigger. I wish, you know, I mean, there's only a couple of casting directors in the area. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, we need a bigger draw to the area to get more work here. Mm -hmm. About some of your um, hobbies. I know you, you're doing some creative imaging. <laughs> uh, let, yeah, tell yeah. your fans about that. Um, I, I play around with uh, Photoshop a mm -hmm, lot. Mm -hmm. And... Um, I've just created just 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 using the imagination. Like I've done shirts with my son. I put him on a superhero body. Yes. And yes. I've, I've taken a picture of uh, the family, like different headshots that we've had. And I've 
I, I took a picture in, um, uh, of um, Times Square. Okay. And yes. I put us up on the billboards in the Times okay, Square yes, and blew it yes. up to like a big, you know, portrait. You know, yes, I've done all yes. kinds of things like this. It's fun. Mm -hmm, and I, mm -hmm. Matter of fact, I don't know if you saw the little Christmas thing I did with me and my wife at Santa oh, Claus yes. and Mrs. Santa. Yeah, yes, yeah, I so, did see that. Yes. Yeah, yes. So I, play, I, I play around with that. Yes. I also draw. I really get into my art. I just did. I just did a picture recently of my grandmother. I saw that. Did you see that? That yeah. was beautiful. Yeah, that was now that photo, I mean that painting came from a photo image. Yeah, I drew, actually it's a sketch. A drawing. sketch yeah. from a, yeah, just a picture that I had of her. Right, right, yeah. right, oh, right, right. Singing is one of your hobbies too, yeah, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, you know, I actually I started to singing before I even got into the acting. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And um, after, when I was I went to school in Virginia, Virginia State, I did plenty of talent shows down there. Okay, ball, okay, man. okay. And then um, <clears throat> the music industry industry kind of took. A change toward the late 80s and early 90s mm -hmm. and um, I don't know I just felt like it just wasn't the same you know the mm -hmm. old R&B style mm -hmm. I used to, you know I, I guess I'm old school kind yes. of cat you know yes, I mean I, I actually I hear some of it coming back now mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. you know like I um, uh, uh, Raphael Sadiq's uh, yes. album, that thing was nice, yes. man. That yes. was off the chain. Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, see, I could get into that. Okay. You know what I mean? So, so uh, who are some of your, as a vocalist, who are some of your inspirations? Wow. Because my, my inspirations go from groups to individuals. So, okay. it, you know, yes. I mean, mm -hmm. I. I mean, Earth, Wind, and Fire, of course, mm -hmm, you know, and mm -hmm. then uh, say the Isley Brothers. Yes. Mm -hmm. See, I can go into the main ingredient. Okay. Uh, yes. Intruders. Mm -hmm. um, I mean, I could, I, you know, it's across yes. the board, you yes. know. Um, yes. Uh, as as a, um, a solo artist, I mean, of course, you know, you, you have Luther Vandross mm -hmm, and. Mm -hmm. um, uh, let's see who else. Luther, James Ingram, let's okay. see his okay. stuff, man. Yes. Um, yes. Uh, would Will like, Downing. Would you? Oh, I love Will Downing. Nah, I see that. <laughs> <laughs> Would you love to give your fans a song? <laughs> You're killing me. <laughs> um, let me see. I, yeah, I guess you guys can hear I sound a little nasal, but um, let me see. What could I do for you real quick? See, I used to do a lot of falsetto stuff. So, mm -hmm. Do you play uh, an instrument, by the way? I used to. I, what I kinda, instrument did you play? I, at one time, I was uh, playing drums. Okay, all right. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so mm -hmm. I had a little percussion. My son actually started, so I don't know if he's going to finish. The Futures. Okay. Okay. Me and my baby are like two lovers in a tree. Yeah, yeah. Tweedly, tweedly. And I'm so in love with her, and she's in love, love with me, yeah, yeah, twiddly, twiddly, I'm not joining you. <laughs> Wonderful, <laughs> Chris. All right, now you hear me cracking, so I mean, no you might, way. You might I have to cut not, that. <laughs> I am not putting myself out there. Uh-oh, wonderful, yeah, wonderful, was, yes. I'm a little, yeah, you hear me, I, I, I can do better than that. But Yeah, you know. I, and I can actually see you doing a, a, a role, like, you know, if, if there was a role that you needed to play uh, and you're you're doing, Oh, yeah, you I know. can have fun with yes. it. Yes. You know what, I'll, I don't know if I should put it out there because yes, I, I don't have the rights to it or put anything. Put it out there. But I thought, I, would, I, I always thought that it would be nice to do a stylistic story. Yes. You know what I mean? Because yes. I could get into that. Yeah, I, that's what know, I mean. Yes, I can like see you doing something like that. Acting and actually singing. That, that would be hot. That would be hot. Be it's hot. out there. I'm sure, they got, out a, there. I'm sure they got a story. You yes, know what I mean? absolutely. So yeah. what What now is, what's up next for Christopher, man? Um, well, like I said, I, I have um, like maybe three or four independent films that I'm supposed to work on one mm -hmm. day. I've been hearing a lot of buzz going around about the, this one called The Driver. Okay. Um, mm -hmm. Uh, the Christmas Story. Um, mm -hmm. uh, what's it called? The Christmas. Oh God, okay. what's the Christmas? Oh, I can't think of the name. What's the, name of the title? Of, it's with John Hunt. I can't. I'm sorry, mm -hmm. John. I can't think of the title right now. I got mm -hmm. Junior Alzheimer's. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> <laughs> and then um, uh, let's see. Well, I got the scene coming up with um, Steve Martin in mm -hmm. the Big Year. That'll be out this year. Mm -hmm. And there's the uh, work with Toby Regbo and some uh, someday this paint will be useful to you. Um, it's pilot season, so I'm actually it's hoping to get season. something jumping now yes, too, because I'm, yes. you know, I got, I'm on the thing with my, on the, on the phone with my manager almost every yes, day. Yes, you know, yeah, what's wonderful. going on? Get yes, me in, man. Yes, Let's go. So, yes, you know. that's wonderful. That's wonderful. Yeah. Now, look, I want you to look directly into the camera. Yeah. And give some words of wisdom to aspiring artists. Okay, 
inspiring artist. Wow, so nice. Um, if you uh, if you desire to to take this this career on, which is really what it is, you got you really have to really have to love the art. Uh, be true to yourself. Have a good support system. Um, whatever your faith is, keep it close to you. Stay strong. Um, and put on your seatbelt because it's a heck of a ride. Yes, yes, it is. That is yeah. wonderful, wonderful, wonderful advice. Chris, I want to thank you <laughs> You're again for coming out to Celebrities in the Basement. <laughs> Uh, I had a great time. Yes, I, I, I was going to ask you, did you enjoy yeah, yourself I did, here? I yes. did, I enjoyed myself. This has been wonderful. It's overdue, too. Yes, so. it was long overdue, but again, you know, this is the time. This is, now is the time, absolutely. so here we are. Absolutely. And again, I want to wish you the absolute best in all your endeavors. Oh, thank you so much. God bless, thank yes. You. God bless. I want to thank you for tuning in once again. Look out for Christopher Mann. He is doing major, major things in the industry. Again, he is the Oscar stalker, red carpet walker. So look out for him. <laughs> and I want to thank you all for tuning in once again. And just remember, to every one fan, you have two haters. Just stay focused on your dreams. Keep the prayers going up. And you know the blessings will always, always come down. Thank you again. And good night. Tune in next week when my celebrity guest in the basement will be former NFL and CFL running back Franklin Butchie Wallace. Celebrities in the basement, the place to be. Karen Wilder Martin on your TV. Politics, drama, music, sports, arts. Favorite celebs climbing the charts. First hand info on the live. Careers, next projects on the rise. Come visit Karen every week. Never know who's in the hot seat. Celebrities in the basement is the place. Is the